just did a video about freeze-dried cheese, and when I made that video, I meant to mention the difference between freeze-dried foods and dehydrated foods, because if you've never bought freeze-dried, you probably don't even know that there is a difference, and there is, and I, I can show you the difference. Um, here I have some peas that I dehydrated, and you can see how they shrivel up when you dry them out. And here are some peas that are freeze-dried. I just bought these because the peas that I dehydrate myself, I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but they don't rehydrate well. And I wanted to be able to throw some peas into stews or um, pot pies or into fried rice that would rehydrate as quickly as potatoes and carrots. And those peas just don't do it. So I ordered the freeze-dried and I'm very impressed with these peas. Uh, here's some that have been in water, it's just warm water, for about four minutes and they are completely rehydrated and uh, they taste just like fresh peas, straight out of the garden fresh peas. And you see if you're used to um, dehydrated foods you have the shrinkage and then when you add the water back into them they'll come back to a full size like those peas but when you buy freeze-dried what you get is what you basically end up with you see there's really no difference in the size once they rehydrate and the um, freeze-dried foods are very light if you think dehydrated are light these are like styrofoam it's amazing how they do that. I don't even know how they do it, but it's just like styrofoam where you can hear the difference between the two. And I also have a few other foods that are freeze-dried. By the way, when I bought the peas, I was curious as to how much would actually be in the can. You really get a full can of uh, those freeze-dried peas. I'm right happy with this deal. Here's a few more examples of foods that I've dehydrated versus freeze-dried. I have uh, bananas that I dehydrated here, and these are freeze-dried bananas. Um, it's just my personal preference, but I actually prefer the ones I've dehydrated to the freeze-dried. The ones I dehydrate just taste like more like real food and they have more substance to them. The freeze-dried bananas, they're very sweet and they're very light and airy, but they just kind of taste artificial to me, even though I know it's a real banana. And uh, the same thing with uh, dehydrated blueberries, and these are freeze-dried blueberries. And you see how, I hope you can see how The ones I dry end up a lot smaller, more shriveled up than the ones that are freeze dried. And here I have apples that I dehydrated versus freeze dried apples. And you can see how they don't shrivel up like um, de home dehydrated vegetables, I mean fruits and vegetables do. They pretty much retain their original shape and size when they're freeze-dried, but they're so light, it's like eating air. If I was hungry, I would hate to think what I would do that. And if you want a, a simple, cheap way to tr taste some freeze-dried foods, you can buy a little bag of freeze-dried fruits in the baby food section of your grocery store. Um, in fact, that's why I bought the freeze-dried fruits was for my grandbaby because she liked the the ones uh, in the baby food type so well. But it turns out I was afraid she would choke on blueberries and some of these things were just too sharp or too sour for the raspberries. She couldn't eat that. And, um, so anyways, you can try freeze-dried fruits that way and... Another simple way to try freeze-dried is to look in the camping section at Walmart. They sell freeze-dried foods there, a mountain house variety. I tried um, ch 
chili. I tried the chili mac version, and it was pretty good. The chili tasted like Hormel chili, and um, if you taste one of the noodles, you'll quickly see the difference between freeze-dried and dehydrated, because I expected the noodles in it to be just like noodles I buy at the grocery store, but they're not. They're just like air. They're, it's hard to describe. It's kind of like, feels like styrofoam. But they rehydrate back to what you would expect. So, hope it helps.